It's funny. Happy Sunday night. Boy, is it a nice night out. I was just sitting outside for a while, relaxing. It's not too hot. The air smells a little bit like um, we're moving towards fall. Everything's drying out a little bit. And um, I don't know, there's a fall vibe out there. So whew, we got to talk about Bath and Body Works lip gloss. But first, I am trying really, really hard to get more Halloween bracelets in my Etsy store. Um, a lot of you have been messaging me about custom um, like sizes and stuff. It's really hard for me to do custom sizes right now. Um, I tend to be like a like wild artist with these. <laughs> and I just like every each one is hand designed. And um, I have like a whole selection of beads that I grab from. And sometimes it's really hard to find um, the beads after I've made them, like, you know, to put them in order in the exact same way. So what I'm trying to do is just do like a really large selection of like size six, seven, and eight in like eyeballs and pumpkins and ghosts. But um, unfortunately, they're really hard to duplicate um, because some of them my mother makes, some of them my daughter makes, some of them I make. And um, we're like, we're like wild artists with the beads. <laughs> We have a ton of beads. Um, these aren't just like craft store beads. We get these um, at higher end companies. And uh, yeah, it, it's definitely like more of an artist project. So if you noticed, um, they're kind of all original. So that's kind of why we're, I try if someone says, you know, can you do like um, an orange one with like a crystal, I'll try and duplicate it, but it doesn't always work. So. <laughs> If, you, if you're wanting to know about that, that's kind of like the backstory uh, behind these. Like, it's funny, like this set, um, I think my mother made one of these and I made two of them. And they're really, like I said, just all original. But if you look at our Etsy store, you'll probably find something you like. Uh, they're all different and they're all really fun. So definitely check those out. A lot of people have been asking about them. I love doing the Halloween bracelets. It's such a joy for me to make these. So anyway, we got to talk about Bath & Body Works lip gloss. What is going on with the lip gloss this year, you guys? Um, the designs are really pretty. They look very fall-like. I already reviewed um, the Halloween set, Candy Corn and Sour Gummy. I like the Sour Gummy a little better. The formula is fine. I have no problem with the formula, but you can't smell these very much this year. Sour Gummy is supposed to be like a sour fruit. Get a little bit of sour fruit. Candy corn doesn't really smell like candy corn to me at all. Um, so I, I've been using the sour gummy. I always layer these on top of my lipstick. I am over 50. And um, I always feel like when I have um, glossy lips, I look a little bit uh, younger than I do with like matte lips. <laughs> so I always use a gloss over my lipstick. Um, the two new ones that I just got are warm apple pie and pumpkin cupcake in the clear tube. And these have a tint to them, but you can't see the tint on your lips or anything. Um, warm apple pie, if I put it on my hand here, I mean, there is like no tint at all when I put it on my hand. This one smells a little bit like sugar, a little bit like apples. I'm not getting like really warm apple pie from it. Um, they work. There's just not a lot of flavor or scent to these. Like usually when I put a lip, lip gloss on, oh my gosh, the Bonfire S'mores one from the summer. I have that around here somewhere. I don't know where it is. That one was fabulous. That was really fragrant. Um, but for some reason, these haven't been too fragrant, which is weird because um, the tropical ones and these skinny tubes were really good this year. I think I have, do I have that one sitting here? Um, I thought I had my mango one. Yeah, I do. Check it out. I've got my, um, no, guava. Guava with coconut. Um, this one is really, really fragrant. Really fragrant. I like the guava one. Um, I liked all the tropical ones this year, but for some reason the fall ones um, just don't have a lot of scent. Uh, same thing with pumpkin cupcake. Um, orange in the tube. It's a very, it smells like pumpkin cupcake in the body care, but it's very, very light. Um, so some people might like that. If you don't like a heavy scented lip gloss and you just want something fun to put in your purse, the formula is nice. 
It's very slick. It's not sticky at all. And um, it looks great over lipstick. They also have the marshmallow pumpkin latte and the champagne apple and honey in the lip balm. Now the balms are like, I think these are like shea butter. Uh, they go on very dry. No scent, no scent in this one at all. Um, I don't know what's going on with this, but again, if you like the formula, you know, they're cute for fall, although they are pricey. Um, the lip balm is $10.50 for this little guy. If you got it during the $2.95 sale, that was the deal. I mean, absolutely. Wait for the $2.95 sale. Um, these lip glosses are $9.50. The little tubes, like the Bonfire S'mores, was only, um, I think that was $8.50. Um, by the way, I just had this on my desk. Oh my gosh, I got to clean up over here. I did get the marshmallow pumpkin latte in the scrub. It was funny. The other yesterday I was talking about the scrubs and um I knew I bought one of these. <laughs> you guys remember I was looking for it. I'm like, I know I bought it. So that's one thing I wanted to do is smell this. This smells a lot better than um the body cream, by the way. I always loved the scrub in the marshmallow pumpkin latte. It smells really good. So I hope you got one of those yesterday. But marshmallow pumpkin latte and the lip balm, again, on the really, on the light side. And then, of course, um, we have a lip scrub. These lip scrubs usually get fairly good reviews. Although, again, um, I'm not really smelling it that much. Uh, these are kind of like a light exfoliant. It's orange. Not getting a huge uh, scent off of this one, although they're cute. They make nice gifts. But... I don't know. Let me know what's going on. If you know anything about the lip gloss this year, I'm really hoping um, they bring out some really um, nice ones for Christmas. I always love the Christmas lip gloss. I love like uh, winter candy apple. I like the twisted peppermint. I'm hoping we get a few different ones. So anyway, um, let me know what you think of the uh, Bath and Body Works lip gloss this year. Have you had any luck with these or did I get duds? I don't know. Anyway, oh my gosh, you guys, it's 618. I'm actually early tonight. I'm excited because I want to put some more bracelets on and um, hopefully tomorrow we get new product. I will see you guys then. Bye-bye.